Do you want a job offer from the company you really want to work for? If so, you've come to the right place because in today's video, I'm going to show you how to get the job you really want. Watch this video to the end to learn the three things you need to do to write a standout CV and to ace the interviews. Hi, my name is Joy Randolph and welcome to my home. I'm a career trainer who helps millennials find work they love and become great at what they do. On this channel, I'll show you how to do meaningful work and increase your income so that your career is something that you love and supports the life you want. If you want to learn how to do this, join me and subscribe to this channel. So the fact that you're watching this video tells me that there's a job you want and you want to know how to get it. But the problem is you've been finding the job search process pretty frustrating. You've been sending your CVs and maybe a lot of companies don't get back to you. Or worse, you've been heartbroken because you've been interviewed by another company before and you thought you'd get the job, but then the company turns around and say that they don't want to hire you. And that just sucks. The big question is, what do you do? How do you get a yes, we want to hire you instead of a no, we don't want to proceed you to the next round? Let's start by addressing the number one reason why you get rejected. And it's this. You get rejected because companies don't think you are the right fit for the company. Now, what does this mean? The easiest way that I can explain it is to ask you to imagine buying a new pair of jeans. Now, if you're a woman watching this, then you'll totally understand what I mean. But when you're trying to find the right pair of jeans, it's really difficult. A lot of jeans don't quite fit. Even if some things work, there are other things that doesn't. And there's nothing worse than having a pair of jeans that don't fit that well. Well, it's kind of similar for the company, except they're trying to find the right fit for their team, for their company, or their role. And the mistake that a lot of people make is when they apply for a job, they think they should get it simply because they want the job and they think they can do it. When actually having experience or having the skills isn't enough. You need to be the right fit in the organization because the perfect fit means that you will thrive and you'll be really successful in that role. Big question is, how do you look like the right fit? Well, really there are three steps that you need to follow. Now, the first step is you need to learn what makes you different. And what I mean is you really need to learn about yourself. A lot of people think they know who they are and all that sort of stuff, but not really. If I was to you know, bring you into my home and we were to work together right now and I'd ask you, tell me 10 things about you that make you different, that make you unique, you might struggle. A lot of people struggle. And the trouble is that if you don't know much about your purpose, what you want to do with your life, you know, where you see yourself in five years, the types of work you want to be doing, about your personality, you know, what types of people you like working with, what types of situation you work well in. I mean, I can go on and on and on. If you don't know all these different things about yourself, then you'll really struggle to communicate why you're different and why they should hire you. And if you're struggling to communicate why you're different and why they should hire you, then it's no wonder that they will struggle to understand why you're different and why they should hire you. The second thing you need to do is to learn as much about the company. Now this is when you kind of put on your, your journalistic sense on. Now I'm not sure if any of you watch things like Wendy Williams um, or you know some TV shows where they really try and get the dirt on celebrities. Except you don't really want to get the dirt on celebrities, you want to get the dirt on the company. That means knowing more than just what you see on their website. That means you know everything about you know the word on the street about them, what the news is saying about them, their issues, their problems, their challenges. Because when you understand the problems and challenges the company has, and you understand what type of people they hire, what type of people they love um, having in their team, then you'll really know um, what you can bring and what you can offer to the table. And you'll also know what offer what skills you can offer to help them solve their problems and their challenges. A lot of people that interview at companies don't know what problems or challenges they have. They might know what the company does, but they don't know more than that. So having that extra level of knowledge will really, really help you um, stand out and actually look like someone that really understands the company. And then last but not least, the third thing is you need to spot the connection. Once you know about yourself and you know what makes you different and you also know about the company, then you're able to kind of see where you guys match and really see if you really are a good fit. 
kind of like a matchmaker. So try and spot as many similarities as you can. So for example, um, is the company's mission aligned with your personal mission? Are the company's goals aligned with the types of goals that you have in your career? Is the company culture perfect for someone that has your personality and background? Just try and think about as many similarities as you can. And once you have a huge list of similarities, um, then you're really in a great position to say why you are the right fit, why they should hire you, and the best bit is, is that you will genuinely be the right fit. If you found this video useful, then I invite you to sign up for my Get The Job training. This is a free five-day training where I basically go into depth on how to best write your CV, how to prepare for interviews, and I really show you how to get the job you want. So yes, just click the link in the description box and you'll learn how to get the job you want in 30 days and also how to increase your income by up to 40%. Anyways, that's it for me for this week. I really hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and I hope to see you again. Bye. Rise some time, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I wanna be the right fit. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Video games. Something about to change. I used to be sending CVs, but not right now. I get the job.